Hey guys, Rob here from Pimp My Song. Um, the last video we put up, I was just showing you our new pair of Bees Knees Lulu small diaphragm condenser microphones. Um, so, as I said in the last post, we're just going to be going through some um, some demos and showing you a bit around those mics and what they can help you achieve. But today, what I'm going to show you is a really cool hybrid acoustic miking pattern. So, if you have a quick look here, we have the two Lulu small diaphragm condensers. Um, we've got them set up on this little Rode stereo microphone bar, which is quite handy. It gives you some markings and measurements to go off, which is really great. But we're also throwing in our Bees Knees Arabella large diaphragm condenser in the middle there. Um, so, this is a really cool miking setup because you can point these slightly away from the, um, the sound hole of the guitar here and just add a little bit and they give you a, like a left and right sound on the guitar but then the large diaphragm is set up as well to give you a very strong center channel um, and we're going to take a quick look at all three channels there and what you can achieve with those okay so we've just recorded a bit with the three microphones you can see the first channel is the lulu left audio two is lulu right and the third channel is the Arabella Center. Now, when you have all three microphones here, there's a buildup of low end, about 200 hertz and general sub. So I've also just thrown on the end an EQ. You can see here I've got a low end roll off, as well as some pretty heavy 200 hertz reduction. But that's to offset all these microphones in proximity and also being such close proximity to the sound hole of the guitar. Um, the way it's set now, makes it sound more like the guitar naturally sounds. The other thing you can do too is play with where the center microphone sits. If you pull it right out, you've got the two Lulus left giving you a hard left and right stereo pan. Uh, this is going to sound great on stereo sources, but if you want a very full guitar sound, I prefer it with um, the center channel maybe at halfway for some sound sources, depending on how wide you want it to sound. But especially because we've got the EQ pulling out a lot of the low mids and low end. Um, it doesn't have that thicker sort of muddy sound so I'm quite happy with it sitting at unity gain here again. So the combination of all three mics here is giving us a great, uh, very sweet, dry acoustic guitar sound to work from. Obviously with the three mics you're getting a very wide and deep and very 3D kind of image happening on that sound. But uh, obviously life is too short to leave things dry so let's have a quick look at how this brushes up with just a very quick reverb and compression setting to give you an idea of how this can be polished up as well. So I've just applied a little bit of reverb and a tiny bit of compression as well on the master output. Um, so let's run this from the start to give you an idea of the, the beautiful raw guitar sound with the three microphones with a little bit of processing on it as well. Mm -hmm. 